Hi everyone, it's Living the Good Life. I wanted to show you some of my finds and I have went, been to two family run estate sales. So that's what you're gonna see today. Um, at the sale where I have most of the finds here on the table, I did get um, some jewelry, quite a bit of jewelry. And I'm gonna show that to you in a separate video. So here we go. Um, I found these vintage glasses. I did not even look at the time to see if they were gold. I have one pair of gold ones from a different sale and these are gold filled so these are i don't know what do y'all think i think these are probably from the 20s um so here we go these might be a little bit older these seem to be the oldest there's also these those are the ones i think are the oldest there's these and then i got an extra case because that was in bad shape i couldn't i couldn't resist this this is a tin of toyland peanut butter i think it cost me one dollar also, at a separate sale, I got these three fairy lights. This is um, Daisy and Button, and it is Ellie Smith, and they are going for a really good amount of money, $40 to $55 online. This is a Viking Owl tea light. Really neat. Just show you how it comes apart right there. These are even more. These are like $80. I paid uh, $5 for each of the Ellie Smith, and I paid $4 for the um, Owl. And just so I mentioned, I got a dollar a piece for the glasses. And then I bought, bought this at the same place as the glasses and the peanut butter. This is a toy wash stand. Your towel would go on the bar, your pitcher and basin on top. And then after you were done, you'd put the, in the water probably in a little basin underneath here. I opened this up for the first time and I didn't realize it had old foam or old glue in here. And I immediately thought it was like termites or something. But um, I went and scraped at it, looked at it, and that's just like the old glue. I guess there was some kind of lining. I'm going to have to try that. And down here, it's the same thing. It just looks horrible there. But it's awfully cute. Uh, and that was $5. I've got a vintage smoking stand with a little bird here and a little red ashtray, I guess. If you think this is something other than a smoking stand, let me know because the people sold it to me as such. And this was $5, so that was really neat. I got a vintage stereoscope for $5 with all of these World War I uh, battlefield and military preparedness videos so here's the stereoscope and you hold it down there look through here and you see the stereoscope so here's there's a whole about box full of these as you can see how many I got but like here's one uh, here they are in training and just all kinds I mean and I kind of am, you know, I told you before, I, I love, like, the um, Regency time period. I love the early 1900s as well. So I'm fascinated with the nurses who, who went over there and took care of all the injured men. So all of those, $5. Uh, I also, at a separate third estate sale, I realized this was in a nightstand, and I started digging through it. There's all kinds of religious medals in here, and I'm gonna test a few of these because some of them don't say sterling, but you know, some of them look like they could be. Here's the ones that were. This was a bookmark that is sterling. It says it right there. Here's another medal that is sterling and it's marked up here. Third medal, it's also marked not the bottom. And this was in a little plastic bag inside there, so it always pays to look everywhere. And it says 14 carat. I think it's right there. Oh, there it is. So, those were, I think, a dollar or two for all of everything that was in that little bag. Um, I got it in a huge bag of stuff. To update you, I have done some testing. This is absolutely nothing. It is not gold. <laughs> These are the uh, part of the um, spoons that I got last week. I tested them. Not sterling. Not sterling. But they had a chance of being it. 
I never have been able to figure out what that little mark is there. So that's what I found, and I will have another video for you very soon, and maybe some more shorts. I'm trying to go ahead and upload some shorts um, just to um, give you updates on things and let you know how everything stands on previously purchased items and whether they work and whether they're gold or silver. So look forward to little um, little videos in the future. Take care. Bye-bye.